Like I said, the most important one I think is your metabolism. It really yeah. kickstarts it. I have to tell the truth. I eat bagels a lot in the morning. You know what? I feel like anything in the morning doesn't count as much. Dude, yeah. when I eat breakfast, okay, this is a true thing. I'm not as hungry like at night. We're supposed to eat breakfast. It's not usually my favorite like meal to eat, even though breakfast foods are like, the best food. Then at night, I don't feel like I need to like eat like a billion things. So I try to kind of go in order here. <laughs> <laughs> yes, drinking shot. <laughs> I was like, wait, let me take a sip of my water. And she just starts, let me take my water. Wait, that wasn't funny. I feel like let me take her water. Let me take her water. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ah! Ah! yeah, the world doesn't no. think it's funny. There we go. The universe thinks we're dumb. Wait, let me take water. water all over us. <laughs> so basically, <laughs> anyways. Um, okay, the next tip is kind of a diet and workout tip. It is how to stay motivated, which I think is the hardest thing when trying to get into a healthy lifestyle. Uh, before I tell you about this next one, what I'm gonna do is link like right in the description So it'll probably be easier if you don't like, follow along if you download it while I'm talking to you Obviously, it's free. I'm not gonna be like guys pay to hear what I have to say I haven't shown her it yet, so I was gonna like yeah, I'm gonna reveal it on camera uh -huh. It's just called pump up and you guys might have heard of it or maybe not I think it's pretty big It gives you a bunch of like different goals like what do you want and you pick it so it could be Do you want to get toned build muscle or just be healthy in general? So first of all you just pick that like you pick whatever category you want and then it lets you customize things where you just like it just asks you questions basically it's like kind of like a quiz and then it just gives you a workout schedule that's so yeah, it's cool. pretty awesome and it makes you all sorts of workout plans that you can just do in your house so you don't need to do a gym membership which is expensive you can interact with other people in it it's oh, not just like a workout like creator community. yeah it's a community uh -huh. exactly so it's definitely like it's been what's helping keeping all of these like things together about like what I want to put in my body what I want to do and I like creeping other people's like healthy food picks oh that type I of love thing that. yeah that is where we get like ideas for our awesome snacks which you will see soon I feel like I was like late on the game too I feel like a lot of people have known about it uh -huh. yeah I need things to be easy and simple for me to do them me like too. attainable uh -huh. <laughs> so this is how I keep track of everything this might shock you but don't go on a diet mm -mm. nope So we have figured out that diets and also, you know, there's a lot of studies to back it up, but going on diets is not going to do anything for you. It might feel like, you know, you're sticking to a set plan that you get, like someone gave you like a diet or something and you're like, okay, I can do this every day. It seems like structured and easy to follow. But if you don't eat enough, your metabolism, kind of like the breakfast thing, it slows down. Yep. Mm -hmm. And your body actually starts to think that it's like starving. So what'll happen is you won't lose weight because your body will hold on to what it has because it thinks, oh, I'm not getting food, I need to hold on. So rather than burning the fat or helping keep you lean, it'll just hold on to everything. And actually, it's been proven that your body is more likely to burn muscle like faster yes. than fat. So eating you all the time. You want your muscle, you want your muscle. Yes, it's like yes. super important. So the next tip is you definitely want to try to, rather than like spreading your meals out to like three huge meals, which is way harder for your body to digest and break down and use, it's better to kind of almost snack throughout the day mm -hmm. and eat like healthy foods that are full of protein and fiber and just keep your body fueled so that you have energy to go throughout your day. And I know at first you're probably thinking, oh my god, but that's like more effort because that is like six meals I have to think about and fix myself. However, we have came up with six mealy snack things, so you'll probably want a little bit more than this. Like high protein, low sugar, really good for you snacks, and we have like done them all and shown you how to make them like completely on her channel in her video. So kind of excited about that. So if you need any type of ideas, we're making it like really, really easy for you. So you'll like want to jump on the health wagon. Yeah. This next tip is another kind of like workout tip, and it is paired thing. It mm -hmm. is friends plus the outdoors. I don't know. So that has friends plus outdoors. <laughs> In my um, winter fitness tip video because I'm not gonna tell everyone like go outside it's winter but I feel like it's summer it must be like somewhat warm where you live and you mm -hmm. should get out outside I sounded so outside. Canadian uh, you're so Canadian oh gosh okay most people do not want to go outside in Canada a lot of times of the year so if you do need to like go to a gym or something I would say still go with friends because you think of it as like a fun social thing that like and again time passes yes. way quicker when you're having fun uh -huh. and then it's not something that you think of like oh working out this like lonely hard thing I have to put into like my weekly schedule you think of it as like oh my god friend time like hangout uh -huh. time fun time Te like you know you kind of like motivate each other and like yeah oh, it's fun. and that's a good thing too is to like I feel like when you centralize 
activities with friends. I don't know if the sentence is gonna make sense at all, but like when you make your activities around something super positive and good for you, it's just, it also helps your friendship because you're focusing yes. on positive yeah. things. When you, and some of you might be like, all right, city girl, this is obvious, but it's not so obvious to city girls. When you get outside, I feel like it gives you a chance not only to get moving, but you also, it's like you mentally become clear because